so today I'm going to be showing you how to basically shade in skin and hair using markers on any sort of person. So first thing you want to do is have your sketch ready. Once you're happy with your sketch, you can decide on what base color you want because this is the first layer that we're going to apply and it's going to be the skin tone. So I'm going to be using Dusky Pink by Brush Marker. I like them because they have this brush tip which makes it really easy to blend and to get in all the like, creases. Um, and it also has a chiseled nib, which is really good for covering large spaces at the same time. Now that we have Dusky Pink on there, I'm gonna go on with a little bit of a darker color, which is Praline, and just define like the cheekbones, under the jaw, forehead, a little bit of the nose, just like define those points, and yeah. So you can outline as you go, or you can do it during the drawing, but I like to do a little bit of both right before I start the hair, just so I have an idea of where the shadows need to go. And then another tip is right here in the middle, oh my god, <laughs> right here in the middle, there should be like a little bit of skin, so when you do the hair, it'll more, it looks more realistic. For the hair, I'm going to be using a variety of different shades just so I can get the highlights right, uh, because I know black hair is tricky. So yeah, just make sure you focus the light on top and then the darkness on the bottom of the trend. And then you're done. Um, you can add a red lip if you would like. I'm going to use the color Burgundy.